Hi everyone, Andy Bates here, and it's been a long time since I've done one of these. This is a walking vlog. Um, so basically, I've just finished off doing a live stream, a uh, flight simulator live stream, and I said halfway through that I wrote a note. I wrote a note on the live stream saying uh, controls on joystick when at gate, and I totally forgot, even when the note was right in front of me. So this vlog is basically to tell you what buttons and all that that I've got on the joysticks. These are my, uh, hold on, let's get out, there we go. Um, my mate has let me borrow these joysticks. So, we're going to start off with the throttle, I think, yes. Okay, so, <clears throat> the throttle here has tons of buttons, and there's a couple of buttons I don't use, and there's a couple of buttons that I do. So basically, you've got the normal throttle that you'll lift forward, and then lift back. Like so. Then you've got, <clears throat> see if you can see, you've got this little button here. That'll be the seatbelt chime. So whenever you hear on my videos, uh, that little ding, that's me pushing that button basically. Underneath it, you'll have this and that. That'll be my rudders. So when I'm taxiing on the runway, I'll go like this to turn left and then that to turn right. It's quite, uh, quite awkward to get to, but it's, uh, it's all right. And then the rest of the buttons I don't really use. Honestly, I don't use these, these, or anything like that. Just that, this, and then obviously them. Moving on to my joystick. Okay, so there's a lot of buttons I use on this. Okay, so let's start off with the top bit. So here is the first... Well, actually, hold on. Let's start with this bit. So you obviously you've got your default up, down, left, right. So mainly when I'm flying, I'll use that to lift up lift the nose up to take off and then I'll, I might do a little bit of that to pull the nose down when uh, coming into you know uh, coming into land then you've got the bit on the top so you've got my speed brake so when I land I'll click that and it'll, the speed brakes will come up you've got my flaps so to reduce the speed and drag on the plane and um, create drag sorry on the plane I'll use the flaps this is to use my to look around the airplane and then this is for my autopilot. So I'll activate that and it'll look, activate the autopilot button. On the back here, you've got my gears. So I'll push that and the gears will go up or down. Your default brake. So when I land, I'll, I'll proper hold that in for ages. And when I'm parked, I'll click that in. And that, that's my parking brakes, basically, basically. And that's it. That's basically, it's just a normal USB lead. If I can get it. It's just a basic USB lead, like so, and you plug it in, and I've just defaulted all controls to that, and that's it. So, yeah, so I'm sorry that I forgot to do that in my live stream, but uh, I think it's time to get the camera back out, so this is my vlog, so hi. Okay, I'm going to stop now. Um, so I think that's everything, yeah, that's everything. Alright, so now you know how, uh, what I use to fly the plane. Link in the description to my twitch.tv channel which is our live stream and I'll tend to do a live stream of a video every week. I try to now. I haven't been able to because I've been on holiday and stuff like that but I'm going to try and do a live stream every weekend or so. Uh, at the moment I've done three live streams. <laughs> three airplane flight simulator live streams. So make sure you check those out. They're all in the link below. I've been Andy Bates and peace out.